and we are so many different cultures, so many different nations that are mixing together. And so the influences that we are, let's say, exposed to, it's too high. People have different upbringings, people have different understandings. So therefore, it naturally comes up that, okay, we need something that is established between us as, let's say, almost like an agreement, which is for you personally, that ethical conduct. I think it's important because it is forming who you are. This is making the difference between somebody who is becoming something because of his environment, the external environment, all these impacts, they have created you. Or you create yourself. Why? Because there is something that you tell to yourself, this is my guide, this is my codex, this is how I want to live this life. And then all these external circumstances, they do not really you know, impact you so much anymore. And yes, so therefore I do think that it's super important to have something like this. In the moment, let's say, if one of us would win in the lottery, unexpectedly, something like this is easy to appreciate. If we are losing something that we really uh, loved, if something is being taken away from us that we really love, it's difficult to appreciate such a situation. But this is human. That is very, very human. So first of all, I really think that we must differentiate a little bit between what is first of all human natural behavior and reaction to it. And then afterwards, there is an underlying, there's, a, there's an underlying story still behind that and on that behind screen I do think that every pain that you are receiving every challenge that you are facing it belongs to your journey it is part of your journey and to acknowledge to accept whatever life is throwing at you and and still have on the mind that this is like just a test this is how i used to think for myself yeah i never begged for an easy life but when challenges are coming right now and especially when you then realize if you want you can overcome them. I think this is something that in a way remains deep inside of you and that you can keep on taking. But especially what also arises together with that is that you have solved something for yourself that many, many other people in this world still have ahead of them. And what does it mean right now again? It means that now that you have went through that hardness, now you can be the guide for others. And to maybe see this as a type of purpose. You go through the hard times in order for others not to go through it so hard anymore. Something like this can only arise if you have cultivated something that in our tradition we call compassion. And in this tradition, at the same time, we also say there are two things which are almost the most important, no matter what you do in this lifetime, to have compassion and wisdom. Compassion and wisdom, those two. These, I would say, like, these are the ingredients for, for the universe being on your side. And then all your faith can go into the universe.